Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Surviving Mars. This is the 1075% difficulty playthrough with no rival colonies. Now, uh, you better believe having no rival colonies makes things a little bit more tense. Uh, is at least if you have rival colonies, you can potentially trade for resources and you can steal colonists. Uh, so, uh, it, once you get a university up and you can train officers, you can steal colonists from rival colonies. And that can help if you have a population crash, like we're just sorting ourselves out of here uh, last time. Now, we have 60 children now, so uh, that's, we're not in a population crash. We got 44 youth. Uh, so, yeah, we're coming up through this and, uh, whoops, we're going to get uh, quite a lot more. Now, uh, we're researching the uh, tech for uh, the space elevator. And once we do that, uh, we'll look at building the space elevator. Uh, we've got the mohole operational. Uh, we've got a rocket running back and forth to Earth with exports of rare metals. Uh, but we've got so many rare metals that uh, uh, we, we need to uh, do something with them. Now, uh, once this exp expires, uh, which it will soon, We'll take this out, and we'll have a little bit less stuff there. But we should... You know, meanwhile, we're building up the resources we need to build the space elevator, which is 400 concrete, 150 machine parts, some number of these things, uh, as some number of these things, I think. Uh, we've, got, uh, we've got lots of stuff, and we'll have the... We have the, the industrial capacity to make what we need. So... Uh, we don't have any uh, real issues there. Uh, we're producing concrete at a uh, sufficient rate as well. Uh, you know, we're producing 24 per, per sol. Uh, so we're going we're gonna to do uh, fairly well there. Uh, don't panic about the starving colonists. That's our uh, renegades and idiots over in the, this dome over here. Uh, by not having idiots and renegades in our main domes, they don't sabotage the main production facilities. And by having them starve, they die out before the dome decides to declare independence. And believe me, you don't want a renegade dome declaring independence. Uh, you really don't. Uh, anyway. Uh, uh, right. So, uh, cause that's the resources. Which one? This one. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. Well, anyways. Uh, we, our population is growing, and, uh, that's good. Uh, we're probably gonna need a new dome at some point to warehouse our people in. Uh, <laughs> yeah, they'll probably be, uh, um, well, unemployed, uh, basically. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it should be fine. Uh, Anyway, our industrial capacity is sufficient to play out the game. Uh, we have enough uh, resources to maintain our colony. We can maintain our population. Uh, but one thing I'm going to do uh, is uh, I'm going to build a... Uh, I'm going to build a outside ranch. Uh, why? Because uh, by doing this, we have more uh, uh, resources, uh, more food uh, resources, and uh, and that is uh, uh, that's uh, going to be important. Now, these things they produce very slowly. But they do produce a lot, and uh, that will. Uh, I'm going to do that now to avoid uh, any particular uh, uh, issues uh, later. Uh, so, having built it now, now if we go ahead and uh, uh, grab a water pipe, uh, we can do this. Yeah. And that will uh, make sure it's all connected up to the uh, stuff. Now, we're going to grow cows. Uh, 
which take 12 souls and produce 300. We're going to do cows. We had a Mars quake. Okay. Right. Uh, okay. Building's not working. Ah, uh, yeah, that's fine. Those will repair themselves. Uh, new project capture ice asteroids. We completed capture ice asteroids. We've got a cold wave coming. Uh, and we're all good. Cold wave? Not a big deal. Uh, we can deal with a cold wave. Uh, now, uh, what have we got up here in orbit? Uh, we've got magnetic shield, uh, which I think maybe we uh, want to launch a magnetic shield. Uh, but that requires building a rocket. Um, you are... You're ready to land... Uh, you can land over here. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, right. Okay. Now you... Uh, exports are allowed. No, you're just going to go back on uh, trade duty. Uh, so uh, I want to... I want to get enough... Uh, uh, resources built up to build the space elevator uh, for when uh, uh, orbital engineering finishes. Uh, we're down to 40, uh, 41 vacant work slots, which is uh, good. Um, okay, so we've got fewer children now, but we still have 49. Um, yeah, so I'm going to need to build another dome at some point. But once we've got uh, some of this uh, stuff over here out of the way, uh, well, actually, well, we're at forty-one percent uh, temperature, so that's uh, that's kind of good. Uh, Thirty point, yeah, okay. We're losing atmosphere at point one eight nine per sol. So, I guess uh, what I want to do is. Uh, yeah, get that magnetic shield up there. Uh, well, if I go in here, and we go in here, uh, we can build a rocket, say, over here. We do actually have the resources to build it, so let's just build it. Yeah, we'll just build it. Now, what are you? You aren't fully staffed. Okay, I see. Right. Okay. Um, but we'll build a rocket. We'll send it up there. And uh, uh, we'll make the magnetic shield. Uh, because why not? Uh, okay, yeah. So we'll, uh, we'll get that rocket built. Um... Meanwhile, we've got a bunch of stuff doing its thing here. Um, good. Uh, we got a salt to the cold wave. Yeah, that's not a big deal. Uh, right. Our uh, workforce is steadily uh, filling in as our uh, youngins come up to uh, uh, employment age. Right, so we're down to, yeah, so we're going to have uh, full, uh, everything will be full uh, in a bit. That will be good. Uh, I would very much love to have unemployed colonists. Uh, so this here, you know, we're, we're producing our uh, food here. Uh, let's um, make this guy uh, maximum, uh, yeah maximum priority so that the food production doesn't get um, you are well you're an export rocket for the cure tatoes so yeah why not uh, we're up to solve 407 now uh, 407 is uh, you know quite a long long bit here before getting to the, to this point 
But if you recall, it was well, it was past Saul 100 when we brought our first colonists in. Uh, well past Saul 100 when we brought our first colonists in. And uh, you know, that's probably why uh, this uh, playthrough has not failed. Because we have brought our uh, full, uh, our colonists in uh, later. Um, now it's been expensive, uh, you know. And now, and now I'm just gonna, we're just gonna take a look in here. We'll we'll take a look in a supply pot and just show you uh, polymers. Like these things get more expensive, so polymers, you know, they're up to 210 million for five. Uh, machine parts are 270. Electronics are 300, right? Uh, and that's because uh, we have the inflation uh, rule set here. Uh, so things get a lot more expensive uh, the longer you wait. And that was, uh, that was an important point. Now, we're, we're, we're getting close to finishing up. The outsourcing is about to expire. Uh, but we're getting close to finished with the... Uh, uh, with the uh, um, research for the space elevator. Uh, once the space elevator is done, I can turn off the automatic mode on the rockets and we can export uh, the uh, rare metals through the space elevator. And that will, uh, that will certainly uh, not uh, harm anything. We're down to 24 uh, open work slots. Uh, which means just about everything is uh, busy now. Hmm. You. Uh, well, we'll automate you. We've completed orbital engineering. Dome heating. Your attention is required. Um... We will repair it because we have the resources. Uh, okay. So we're uh, drawing 164. We're, we're storing 164 power uh, during the uh, day. Uh, so, you know, there's that. Uh, only two souls remaining on the cold wave. So, you know, uh, there's that. That's, uh, that's pretty good. Um, Okay, now we we need um, if we go in here and we we look in here uh, the space elevator we need uh, 400 concrete which we don't have yet. Uh, what's the Omega telescope? It also needs 400 concrete, right? Uh, but we need 200 metal. Uh, we need 150 polymers, which we have, and 150 machine parts, uh, which we're producing fast enough you know what i think we should build the space up. what what did i do whoops uh i pressed the wrong button is what i did uh uneven terrain uneven terrain blocking objects uneven terrain uh i could stick it here i could stick it there Bam. We're gonna build it. Okay, well let's um let's go in here and uh, take a look. We're building a bunch of stuff here. Um uh, what can we deep metal extraction is not gonna be an issue. Um research amplification, you know, might be vaguely useful. Uh being able to build our colleges might be useful. Uh, maybe. Um, why don't we, uh, we grab that one and we, uh, pause that. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, we'll do that research. Now we'll go in here. Uh, we can outsource some more. Okay. Uh, now... 
Uh, that will get Mars Nouveau uh, done quite a lot faster, uh, which is kind of good. Um, right, yeah, that would be kind of good for sure. Uh, now, anyway, the uh, cold wave will be done uh, uh, reasonably quickly here. 33% uh, atmosphere, so we're a third of the way there. Uh, right. Uh, okay. Now, where are we at? Uh, how's our... Uh, we've got a dome that needs repair. Oh, right. Um, I wish it would show you how close, how much the, uh, Okay, we've exported some rare metals. You know, that's cool. Uh, you. No, you. Um, let's put some more uh, drones on there. Yeah. Um... It is delivering uh, slowly. Uh, right, okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, anyway, uh, right. So, we've got... Yeah, we don't have anything in there right now, so that's not an issue. Uh this, I'm not sure if Mars Nouveau affects um, uh, wonders. It'd be cool if it did, but it probably doesn't. Uh, right. Okay, we are repairing, right? Okay, it's repaired now, finally. Well, that took a while. Uh, okay. Uh... I think this one here is going to need lots of drones up here. Uh, once the uh, space elevator is operational, I imagine it will need quite a few. So, we'll imagine quite a few into it. Okay, so, uh, cold waste just about over. Yay! Uh, once uh, cold waves are gone, we can remove all the subsurface heaters, uh, mostly. Dome heating. Morale, plus 20 for five sols. Uh, Right, okay, good. Um, okay, that's, uh, that's quite uh, uh, useful. Um, right, this is halfway through, okay. Uh, I see, yeah, we've got 700 sponsor uh, research, actually. Um, right. Uh, okay, we've got rockets uh, returning to Mars. Yep. Um, right. Okay. Uh, how much? Uh, cure export. Okay. Uh, right. Now... Uh, we're down to nine uh, open work slots. Uh, wow. Uh, right. So our uh, workforce is... Uh, 
is uh, back up to where it needs to be, I think. Uh, now, these 121 middle-aged people, a fair chunk of them are going to start filtering into being seniors. Uh, so, uh, you know, we're not fully out of it, out of the uh, woods yet there. Uh, but uh, we do have uh, uh, quite a few more uh, 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 colonists, uh, you know, kicking about, right? Uh, and that's, uh, that's kind of cool. Uh, right. Okay. So, um, right. Uh, what have we got here? Uh, we, another rocket. Okay. Our exports have all made it to Earth. We're at 82% on Mars Nouveau. Uh, so there's that. Uh, right. Uh, so we have almost what we need for, um, uh, producing the space elevator. So once Mars Nouveau finishes, we'll just see if it uh, knocks the building cost down. Because uh, that would be cool if it does. Uh, I don't think it does on Wonders, but I, you know, I'd be happy to be wrong about that. You know, really happy to be wrong about that. But you know, uh, ninety-three. Yeah, it's just about done. So. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, right. I might have been right uh, last time about uh, three episodes before we can open the dome. Uh, that would take us to the end of December. Uh, might be four, might be five. I'm pretty sure within four episodes uh, we'll be done. Now, here... Yeah, I didn't change it. Okay. Uh, well, anyway. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll let the space elevator start getting uh, uh, going there. Uh, factory AI. Right. Okay. We'll let uh, factory AI finish. Uh, right. Um... Well, let's take a look here. Uh, we're accumulating resources pretty quickly there. Yeah, pretty quickly. Uh, we're going to uh, basically run out of concrete. And that's fine. Uh, we've got lots of metals. Uh, so we can definitely afford to do that. But it takes a while for these things to, uh, for the resources to accumulate, right? So, uh, but with all of the drones over here, uh, charging around, uh, bringing stuff in there, uh, you know, things are, uh, are improving. Now, uh, I'm going to get rid of these uh, extraneous uh, dumping sites here, since they are empty. Uh... Right, okay, because we don't need them there now that they're empty. Uh, right? Yeah, we definitely don't need them now that they're empty. And, uh, yeah. New anomaly. Ooh. Well, our uh, explorer will charge down there and look at it. So, you know, there's that. But we'll, uh, you know, keep watching in here. Um, well, we've almost accumulated uh, two-thirds of the resources. Um, okay. Okay, let's... Uh, slow things down here. You, uh, we're going to do this. We're going to turn, we're going to send it on an expedition, um, to the, uh, do the magnetic shield. Yeah. Send expedition. 
Yes. And then this one, we're going to do this. And we're going to do this. We're going to send it to the ice asteroids. Send the expedition. Okay. Why are we doing that? Well, because we can. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Now, what are, we're doing topology AI. What this one? Refineries and factories upgrade. Ah, yes. Okay. So we're gonna go in here. Uh, upgrade. We're going to upgrade that. Oh, our uh, explorer can come back. Uh, right. Uh, we're going to go over here. And we're going to upgrade this. And we're going to go in here. And we're going to upgrade this. And we're going to upgrade the fuel pr pr producer thingies. Right. Okay. Um, that's going to use up a bunch of resources, but uh, it's going to produce things faster as well. Um, now, we have no vacant work slots. So, you know, we have that. So, I'm going to actually turn these guys back on uh, because why not uh, seriously why not uh, you know if we get we got enough of them we should be able to keep renegades under control more easily even but it's also you know uh, something for uh, colonists to do. Now, we've still got 55 children, and uh, we're now up to 109 adults and 44 youth, so uh, yeah, that's why our uh, uh, workforce is uh, pretty much maxed out now. Now here, uh, we're just waiting for the remainder of the concrete, uh, and it looks like we have potentially enough. Uh, okay, so the space elevator will get built. Which will be really cool because the space elevator operates in dust storms. And, uh, yeah. Uh, where rockets can't launch or land in dust storms, the space elevator can. And uh, that's, um, that's one of the best reasons to build it, is... Uh, that it does operate in dust storms. Um, right. Okay, so we're a uh, little bit short on concrete, I guess. Uh, but we're producing it, so uh, that will uh, definitely uh, uh, get everything uh, straightened out. Anyway, here um in construction sites yeah so our uh, upgrades are done uh you need for a couple more um good it's building okay low resource food yeah see that's why uh why i was uh building this uh, the food won't be a problem uh, in uh, a sol or so. Uh, this will keep everything uh, sorted out. Also, these farms, which are rotating between cover crops and uh, cure potatoes, uh, will produce a little bit of food right uh, in between. Uh, these ones that are going to be uh, dropping the cover crops uh, briefly. Uh, or shortly. Uh, so, yeah, there's that too. Now, you are the export rocket. Okay, yeah. We'll let that rocket go on. No, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll turn that off. Yeah. Uh, because the space elevator is, in fact, uh, ready to go. 
Um, uh, right. Yeah. Space elevator is built. Okay. So, worst case now, we can get uh, supplies in from the uh, space elevator. Now, let's take a look here. We've got uh, good storage on everything there. Uh, okay. Uh, right. Well, everything seems to be doing okay. Uh, our concrete supply is building up again, uh, and that's good. But now we can import concrete if we end up in a fix. Uh, so uh, that's uh, that's kind of where we want to be. Uh, now let's um, let's go uh, take a boo in here. Uh, we're adapted vegetation. Uh, we definitely want that. Um, and then we want uh, uh, what do we want? Uh, right. We could, uh, no, we don't need to do that. Uh, Sterling generators could be uh, useful. Uh, we have the uh, resource production to manage them. So we'll stick that in the queue. Um, You know, research isn't so much of an issue anymore. Um, we'll grab that because why not? Uh, and we'll we'll research Project Morpheus. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so that so far so good. Now here, our outsourcing has expired. Uh, we'll go in here and we'll outsource some more. Yeah. No close right okay um so that'll get uh stuff uh, sorted out there a little bit uh faster uh right uh we're up to almost 40 percent on uh on the uh uh atmosphere thing uh okay now are there any uh useful uh this here uh, that gives funding. That gives 300 sponsor research. Um, hmm. We could do that just for kicks. Yeah, we'll do that just for kicks. Because we have the resources to do it. Um, yeah, we have the resources to do it. Uh, it won't get up there before the dust storm, but that's fine. Uh, right. Now here, uh, we could turn on auto export here. Or we could... Uh, Um, what's this? Uh, we did, uh, we exported. Yeah. 2.4 billion for a full load of, uh, rare, uh, metals exported. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, it is, uh, you can see the, uh, space elevator. So worth building when you can. Um, right. Dust storm. It's just a regular dust storm. One Sol. <laughs> it's just a regular dust storm. Wild. A missing rover. We haven't had the missing rover. Um... Let's triangulate. Uh, yeah, I, I've been expecting that missing rover uh, event to fire for the entire game. 
and it finally did. Another event that's uh, that will probably fire uh, soonish is uh, a colony. Another colony will uh, get set up on uh, Mars, and uh, uh, we'll get uh, some uh, benefit from doing that. Uh, that that's. Uh, that's the other event that I, I'm expecting to fire at some point here. Uh, I'm not sure when it does, but uh, I think it's a population trigger. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, yeah, I'm not sure at all, actually. Uh, launch magnetic shield. Uh, uh, right. Yay. Uh, the magnetic shield is up. So now if we look here. Uh, we have a magnetic shield, and it's uh, doing some stuff. Uh, I don't know it's actually doing anything useful. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Uh, okay. Um, missing rover. Uh, da, 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 da. We will need to send drones to repair the malfunctioned rover. Uh, it's over there. Uh, you, you have, you're an explorer. Uh, you are a transport. You're a transport. Oh, there is a commander. Uh, okay. Uh, we can send the RC commander out there. Uh, and it will uh, be able to fix the uh, thing. Uh, right, uh, we exported some more. Uh, we are just about to, to get our uh, ranch to uh, produce a stack of food. So the uh, resources running out thing is not an issue for the food. So we're going to get 400 of it right away. Uh, and we just got some from farms, I think. Uh, this is is going to dump uh, 400 odd food in there uh, uh, real soon now as well. Terraforming. Pure rains are now possible. Why did it say terraforming setback? Oh, it went over to pure rains and then it went okay um we got five thousand science from that sweet okay pure rains are now possible uh okay now uh this here is no this here can go back to automated right uh okay uh, you can come back. You can come back. Okay. Right. And here. Uh, that's just about going to uh, finish. Right. Um. Okay, come on. Just tick over already. And uh, yeah, so to be, um, it's amusing to watch this when uh, when it ticks over. Um, right. Okay. It's uh, done now. Um, is it uh, stores uh, more food than it can <laughs> can actually? Uh, it produces more than it can actually store. We've got a meteor storm coming. Uh, but now we aren't going to have a food shortage. And that's why I built that when I did. Uh, uh, that was uh, the reason. Uh, our uh, deposit here has run out. So I can actually uh, get rid of that rare metals extractor one last building that gets uh, maintenance um,
Split power grids. Really? Uh, right. Okay, so that uh, that's one less uh, thing there to uh, uh, to manage. Um, right. Now I think uh, realistically, uh, this here capture ice asteroids. We'll let cap the ice asteroids mission finish, and then I'm going to uh, put the cut. Uh, I guess. Um, Right. Okay. We've completed a, uh, the vegetation one. Uh, we've done that. We can capture more ice asteroids. We had a Mars quake. Uh, three buildings not working. They'll get repaired. Uh, okay. Uh, so uh, I'm going to uh, put the cut here. Now we're up to 25% water also. So I'm going to put the cut here. So uh, that that's going to be all for this time. So. Uh, you know, stay healthy, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much, and see you back next time.